parts. Yeah, he can do it all. He's a fantastic striker. A guy that can mix it up. Oh my god. I ain't looking at a champion right there, man. God damn, bro. Oh, ho, ho, ho. UFC 5. Hey, listen, that last episode, we got concussed. We got bust all upside the head. Shit was tough. So we have a fight against, I think we're fighting Usman, and I'm not I'm not excited about this at all. Uh we've been struggling against low-level players. Um I don't know what it's going to look like once we start fighting champs and all that type of shit. We do have a high hype fight. Um, you know, when we got concussed last fight, we went ahead, we restarted that thing because uh, we on the road to becoming a GOAT. And uh, the only way I've been able to do shit is um, submissions. We're struggling to knock a bitch out. And I don't think we're going to get a knockout this fight. We're going to try to get a knockout probably this episode or the next, but I'm really struggling over here to do that. Let me show y'all my upgrades real quick before we hop into the first fight. Um, now, I have low fitness again. I always have low fitness. I mean, I, I would think that this would start to be enough, but, you know, my I, I have not really touched health. I raised my cardio a little bit, but I need to raise some of these other stats up. Um, all right, let's, let's, let's advance to the fight. I'm scared. I'm scared. Watch how weird the, the ref looks in Bruce Buffer. They don't look real. And Usman, why your head looks stretched out? Like, why he stretched you out? Why he look like that? Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC welterweight champion, Kamaru, the Nigerian Nightmare, Usman. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Ricky Boy. I get a short ass intro. He get that long shit. Ready to fight? All right, guys, we're gonna try to be a little bit more patient. I think I'm doing too much. Time out. We'll see what he does for an encore here tonight. Huge victory his last time out against a high level opponent. Now, an even higher ranked opponent stares in front of him. The octagon door is closed. We'll see if he can extend the winning streak under the brightest spotlight of his UFC. Okay. I don't, I don't really want to wrestle with him. Well, they land for Usman. Oh, there's a takedown attempt. All right, so about a minute into this one, and not much in terms of action. The computer loves that. A little spin. Good time. That thud on the table, that was me falling asleep. I'm sorry, John. I gotta wake up. Guys, get going. All right, so there's the takedown from... Yo, I, I, oh, man, I thought I blocked it. His hands a little bit. They're back to his bread and butter early in this... Well, that's his roots, right? For as good as he is... I'm running into a lot of ground game, people. Jab is, it's always gonna be the rest of... And now, now, I'm, now I'm just getting dominated. Whether it's offensive or defensive, Kamaru Usman will wrestle if he ever wants to be the champion. Oh, he's got the Kamaru locked in. All right, so we got the first one in. And we got a plus 15 for that. And he is back up to his feet. He gets his nice, nice. So now he's about to find uppercuts up the middle to try to do damage to his opponent. Usman gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. He's gotta throw that kick behind him. Get off and that's how you defend the double get off leg, ladies and gentlemen. All right, they separate. Now we'll see who can get off in space. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Damn it. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Shots landing on both sides here. Nice uppercut. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, and stringing them together so effectively. Never doing Well, I've never seen that. Overhand right to the takedown. Recognized all the openings in his opponent's defenses. There you go. His way with him here. Pull him out. Pull him out. Get the ball here. Oh. 
Yes, smart adjustment. Yep. Okay. To go in this one. Excellent ground and pound strikes here. Come on. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Well, he's staying pretty right. effective here. Yikes. I think I won that round. He looked like he relieved for tear that bell. I think I won that round. I'm not sure, though. Okay, I am very happy. He cannot handle your dominance on the ground. All right, we had a good round. That was probably one of the best rounds we had in the series so far, man. Can we match that intensity for the bitches? Ready. Second round here. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Kamaru. Lands the right hand. Solid kick by him there. All right, so not exactly the approach we thought we would see out of this BJJ player. His ground game, you can argue, as good as anyone's in this division, yet he hasn't attempted to take that. I, I would never have expected this, John. I don't understand what is going on in this fighter's head. He needs to get the fight to his wheelhouse, and that is on the ground in the ground. Oh, I finally got one. I never get those. Get off. Well, Come on. There you go. Usman gets stunned there by that stiff jab. Oh, nasty cut there right on the bridge of the nose. So pretty good recovery by the opponent after getting stunned. Ooh. Pretty good. Got to capitalize on those opportunities. I mean, you can't waste these opportunities. You don't get them as often as you'd like. So you get a guy hurt. Got a a strong defense here. The hook to the head is blocked. All right, so there it is again. There he goes. The takedowns pile up. Nice entry to get that one back. Great job by the former champion to get to the position that he Maybe we'll try to... at least early in his career. He's developed strikes, but ultimately, he's a wrestler. Damn. He's to use that wrestling to start Fight everything up. that he wants to do inside Fight the up. I'm getting my ass kicked now. I ain't, ain't going to lie. Beautiful fight instinct there as he reverses position and now he's got the dominant position. Up. Did a fantastic job recognizing, man. I have got to get on the on. offense from bottom to top to dominant position. What a great job. He got a little stamina. He got a stamina. We got him. He's done. He's done. He's got the jump. He's done. He's done. Guys, I know it was another submission. I think I did. Was that? I, I, I looked a little bit better. Absolutely. We did a little bit better this time. Able to accomplish here tonight. As you can and he he kept he kept taking me to the ground. I wanted to, to strike a little bit more, but I he, you know. If you want to keep doing that, now now your feet. Yeah, that's like your fifth. What your fourth loss in a row? He farted at the end too. Y'all hear? <laughs> No, he never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's got to be a little more patient in the strike game and pick our spots instead of trying to combo up. You know? him in danger and finishing fights. All right, here's Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called to stop to this contest at three minutes. Beat your motherfucking ass. Number two, you playing the winner by tap out, Pitty Boy. All right, so there he is, all smiles, and rightfully so, after he gets the job done by submission tonight. You told me off the air before the fight. That was a good fight. I think that was good. I think I did okay. That you can't How I made the coach proud? And his opponent yes, sir. To lay in the guard, he made Not a bad. Submission victory. Got one. We finally got ourselves a little stun. I beat him in almost everything except for the control. I think we did a good job keeping our range there. That's why he was kind of inaccurate with his, his significant his significant strikes, excuse me. We didn't lose too much. Um, we didn't take too much to our longevity. We, I mean, he did get us a couple times though. He definitely put, put hands on us a couple times. That was solid. We earned ourselves a new contract. 550,000. Which one do we want to do though? I'd like to do the hard one to go all the way down to the bottom. Come 
one fight of the night. No. Prestige. No, we can't do those yet. What about this? Three fights which reach high hype. I could do that. We only get 75k for that. Yeah, dude. What's this? 50,000. I think I could do that. Let's do this one. Keep getting the, the fight hype up and we'll get more fans. Yeah, we got 372 right here. We might be able to do this. 128 days? Yikes. Who, who wanna fight? I'm a three star. Everybody's higher than me. Main card. Okay. I'll take it. All right, let's do fight camp. And then we gonna do the second fight. I'll see y'all in just a second. Take for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue. June time. Fighting out of the red corner. The hey, the solid assassin. Okay. All right, you ready to fight, brother? Ready. Do so on the strength of that me up, bro. This is a kickbox. I'm about to get my ass kicked. If this young man can keep it going here tonight. Round one is underway. Dominant performance his last time out to extend the winning streak and to set up this massive, massive opportunity tonight. We'll see if he can take advantage. Put your hands down, buddy. Oh, spinning back fist lands. Oh, that jab alerted his opponent. He closes the distance. Oh, you want to do that? We can do that. Oh, I think you wanted to. There you go with that shit, bro. I'm telling you. I, you, I'm trying to be cool, bro. You don't want to do this with me. You don't want to do this. You don't want to do this. He want to do this. Oh, God, he want to do this. Oh, my goodness, a power bomb. So just when it looked like he power bomb me, he slams his opponent down with authority. Power bomb me. I don't even know how to do that shit. The computer doing advanced shit. He's doing a really good job putting himself in position. Attempting an armbar here. Now you want an armbar. It's pretty tight, DC. It's getting tight right now, John. Oh, he escapes. He got out. I mean, wow. That is great submission defense. Good work, guys. Come on. Yes, yeah, smart adjustment. Yep. Oh, right into mouth. Get off me, man. Right, so to fight back to his feet after that extended battle on the ground, and the crowd is loving it. The crowd's going crazy because they appreciate high-level mixed martial arts, and that's exactly what you just got. All right, so he can take nice one. Strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pick. Oh, you like that? He lands a huge kick. You like that? Vicente Luque gets yeah. down there by that stiff jab. And working that jab again. Overhand punch to the head, blocked though by Luque. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Man, he has been absolutely masterful on the feet this evening and everything. See the computer, bro, when you when you he has had it. When you dodge, bro, they they just be ready for that shit. Used it to set up his other combinations. Expertly done on the feet tonight. I don't know how to get out of those. Strong punch to the head in the clinch. Final seconds of round one. I don't know who got that one. I think he, I think he might have got it. He might have got his look close. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that. You ready to fight? I gotta get my conditioning up too. Let's get to round two. 
All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a bar fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times where they came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. How, man? Huge strike right there. I'm not Three. sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. That was landed clean. All right, different round, but approach out of the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu fighter. I'm not sure if there was an injury, but his ground game is all oh, What the, the fuck? Bro, it's like he barely touched me. Oh, that's a big right hand that got through. Beautiful punch lands. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very Come often. On. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Oh, that looks tight. Okay, he's got it. That's it. All right, good. Jesus. Oh, he got out. I'm going to the ground, bro. Back to his back to create some space between him and his... That camera view, when you stand up, got to get fixed. Luke ain't going with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to go over her very bad. Under two minutes now to go in round two. Fuck. Hurt again. Hurt him. Huge block there. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Now he gets a more dominant position with the... Holy oh, no. So now we are on the ground. Now he is in his wheelhouse. We'll see if he can get one of his submissions to pop here in there. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Posture's up now and lands a devastating... I wasn't trying to do this, but if this is what you want to do... 30 seconds to go in round two. Seconds left. Bleeding from his cheek now. Uh, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you gotta be careful here. All right, round three. I think we got that one. All right, so the round is over, and you see. We got a couple. I gotta check the fight totals. Second round. I think I did a little bit better. First round, definitely lost that first round, though. Now looks like the cut is on the nose. We got to win it here. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course... We got to win it here. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Third round underway. Head to the headlands, flushed there by Luke. Elbows is too hard to... Slips that left hand. Too hard to get. Try to establish that jab. All right, well, that blow is busting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with a super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that oh, shit. is nothing more than something that inspires him to continue doing what he's doing. So you have got to change something. You got to get your head. Ooh, that was my shot. Taking too much damage to that cut. We got him. Oh my God. There's the oh my goodness. You're winning by submission. Oh my goodness. Bro, he put me through hell. I'm not going to lie. Still digesting this result. What a win for him tonight. And he gets it done. He can't, I mean, I didn't really want it. 
go to the ground, but Jesus, he kept doing that shit. All this shot is always fun. He should be very proud. All right, now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, one second of the third round. To playing the winner by tap out, Pretty Boy. Well, the celebration is on in his corner, and hard to blame these guys, sort of waiting to exhale. Oh, get a huge win tonight, and not just the win, but they get it by submission. They knew what they had in front of them. They knew how tough a competitor his opponent was, but they also knew that if they could get this fight to the ground, they could Man, he did. He, he gave me two injuries. He, he really... He gave me a rough time. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. He gave me a little rough time. I might want to take the question mark kick off. The animation takes too long. All right. Let's get into this third fight. Let's see who we're going to take on. What do we have? We got a title fight. Look how high everybody is. Like, I'm a three-star. Oh, God. What is your fight style? Another kickboxer. Leon Edwards. Like, I mean, we can't we can't decline it. This is a chance for us to win the title, bro. This is our shot. Ooh, shit. All right, let me do the fight camp, and we'll be here for the third fight. Let's go. All right. I need new clothes, bro. You don't get shit, man, on this game, bro. But you can buy stuff though. They let you purchase stuff. They let you do that. Like, what is? Look at this. Look at this. This is trash, man. You don't even do any press conferences or nothing. So I don't even know what the point of of having this is. You don't even wear it for anything. You know what I'm saying? Twenty-seven and three. Leon Edwards, kickboxer. Four stars on all the stats that matter. Unfortunately for me, actually four and a half, I think it was. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, this is it. This is it. You fighting for the title. You did all the hard work to get here. You trained. You sweat. You bled. You earned it. I don't have any more sage advice. I just got one more question. Whose time is it? It's my time. Nah, nah, nah. Fuck that. I didn't hear you. Whose time is it? It's my time. Whose time is it? It's my time. You hungry? Yeah. Then get out there and fucking eat. Let's go. You're looking at a champion. Well, when you realize a UFC title shot at 170 pounds, that is saying something most people would argue this is as deep as any division in the UFC. And this man, undeniably the number one contender, as he makes a lot He has separated himself from the pack. The only person left is the champion. He has done everything necessary to be viewed as a guy that could hold his championship belt. Now this moment, he has got to lock in for 25 minutes because it's going to take all of that 25 to beat this great champion. Big spot for this young man tonight. Well, and a lot of his UFC experience, he believes, is going to help him in this setting. He's been measured with his energy all week. Nerves do not appear to be an issue. Time to hate. Championship fight. I don't know if that was going to be copyrighted music or not. If you see a jump cut, just know that it was. Damn, that, his character model looks really good. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. EA, y'all could have gave a damn and, and, and um, had better cap for their, his, his lips. I don't even move correctly. For the undisputed UFC. Welterweight 
Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Ricky Boy. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, let's get it. Early round one, this fight to determine the UFC welterweight champion. And for the number one contender, it took him so long to get this first UFC title fight, he knows he has to maximize the moment. If he doesn't get the job done tonight, he may not get another shot to earn this 170 pound title. So he put a lot of emphasis on getting off to a good start. We'll see if he can do just that. We're scheduled for five five minute rounds. Okay. Okay. Oh, nice straight. That'll work. Oh, and so now he lands another combination. So it's I don't really want him. He got a lot. Of, he gonna be doing a lot of kicks. That's the a only thing. People throw singular strikes. Not this gentleman. This man is stringing four or five, six in a row. What a great job. Fast pace here in the early going. Clem. That left hook was nasty. Points on that one. Oh. Slips. Three minutes to go. Now mixing one into the body. He's got to start kicking. Kicking the body. Nice. He's just got to start kicking. Trying to establish that jab once again. Back and forth. He's killing me with the body shot. Too far. Way too far. Inside leg kick is there by Edwards. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, and stringing them together so effectively, never doing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. What the hell was that? Target there! Great shot, now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot, what they call it, to go and end the fight. Oh, my goodness. Edwards gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Now the uppercuts are coming. He better start moving. He cannot stand here and eat these uppercuts. He's got the single collar tie. How's, yo, how they letting him? Fighters separate from the clinch. Edwards' his nose is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Well, I'm an identical twin. Two is better than one. Well yo, how does he keep doing that? Double the ball jab and you see his opponent's head. I don't know how to do that. Oh, I forgot I had that. Stop, stop, stop. All right, so there's the end of the round. That's a good, that's a good round. One now the cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. We both got cut. This one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. We both got cuts. We got them cuts. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one. I, that I put a cut on his nose from that. Punch or something else? Ready. No right. Round two. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Nice job by Leon Edwards going to the kicking game now. Certainly earned the respect with his hands. Now changes the level. Full on mixed martial arts. Yeah, he can do it all. He's a fantastic striker. A guy that can mix it up. Oh my god. I ain't looking at a champion right there, man. God damn, brother. Shit. Fuck. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me 
can run that back. Shit. Oh. All night. That'll do it. Oh my God. What? All right, so here we what? go. Round one. This fight to determine the UFC welterweight champion. And for the number one contender, it took him so long to get this first UFC title fight. He knows he has to maximize the moment. If he doesn't get the job done tonight, he may not get another shot to earn this 170 pound title. So he put a lot of emphasis on getting off to a good start. We'll see if he can do just that. We're scheduled for five five minute rounds. Oh, beautiful strike in there by Leon Edwards. He has really become a well-rounded welterweight. You saw in the Gunnar Nelson fight how good his wrestling defense was. Leon Edwards is a real problem, BC. Oh, how good is that? Yeah, body kicks is something. Edwards gets absolutely tagged by that stiff jab. Oh, fighter lands another jab. No defense, these two are going back and forth. Oh, and there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch, and the first one you learn is a jab. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Now some spacing as they exit the clinch. He just did like a five-hit combo. That was to a significant extent. I ain't really used to them doing that many punches at a, in a row. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that finish. Ah, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Oh, and there he goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He bro. continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at All his strikes is just faster, bro. It's just killing me. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize what hit him, he's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. Edwards' his nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Clean left punch followed by the right. Oh, that was close. 20 seconds now to go. What? A brutal cut on his nose there. He is bleeding. Man, we both got cuts, man. I, I, I did well for that first two minutes. Or that first, what is he, five minutes? The blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. And then that last, like, bridge of the nose or minute and a half, bro, he, he start rocking my shit. Getting right to work. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has a... You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, round two. Clean with the right hook. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the kicks. target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Edwards. So the blood really starting to flow every time that uh. area gets targeted. That cut's getting worse. It's getting worse and worse. And you see the blood starting to come down. That is when you start to watch the fighter to see what type of effect it's all. Oh, how about the transition to the ankle pick? Now we will see where he Come moves on. from here. Got the ankle pick. Let's see how he advances from this position. Working out a finish off his heel hook. He's got to keep the knee inside of his hips. Cannot allow for him to beat his hips. Good job by the champ there. Sliding back out. Darce short with tip here. That Darce is tight. Oh, he's going to go to sleep. It's over. Right, come on. Oh, he got out. He did a great job of getting his hips away and getting back to his back in order to defend that Darce shoot. All right, under three minutes now to go in round two. 
Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up Damn it. after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Right back. Right well, back. significant swelling now in and around that left eye. Might even be starting to close. Oh, massive kick lands flush. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Under 90 seconds to go. He gets to the single collar dive. Look for him to wear on his opponent by pulling the head down and punching with the free hand. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other side. Yes, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. Oh, now the hook in the clinch by Edwards. 30 seconds to go. Kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad. With his head. Right now he has to find one more strike to end the night. At the top, let it drip, let it drip, let it drip. Oh. What a round! Okay, maybe we've had a good round. All right, so there's the end of the round. It had a little bit of effort. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. I'm going to fuck around and, and, and lose to leg kicks. Oh, looked like he got tagged a couple times there up top. Right oh, he lands another pinpoint strike there. And no surprise to see the swelling upstairs get worse. That accuracy, man, it's something to behold. This guy is... Oh! Oh, he is stunned. Oh, picture-perfect shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, beautiful job with the ankle pick to get him down. Now we'll see where no, he's no, no. to go from here. Got the ankle oh, pick. Come on. Let's see how he advances from this position. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. You gotta be careful here not to... Trying to I'm trying to grab him. But you gotta like the offense we're seeing from keep, him. I ain't gonna lie. Round. The way he defended that, that clinch is kind of crazy. Already right, closes the distance. Gets the follow time. And with authority, goes to the yeah. judo throw right into side control. He's in side control. He's got a ton of options. Oh, he's got a choke. Oh, it's tight. Dar's choke is in tight. He's got to be very patient, though he does not want to rush this if he wants to get in the fight. Oh, how good is that as he gets out? That is great submission defense, keeping everything short and not allowing him yes, to get the submission Come on. Victory. About two minutes here to go in round three. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. Edwards is able to land the strike right there and continuing to make things difficult. Oh, now going to the judo throw. He ends up in side control. A lot of options for him here. Yeah, he can either go ground and pump or he can chase submission. <sighs> Takes his back. Come on. And now he's a tip to choke. Oh, that rare naked. We got him. Add enough. Add enough. <laughs> Had enough. Takes the Had enough. The champ is here. That's a good fight, though. That's a good. Hey, hey look. That's a good fight. We get a little too bloody. My legs was was keep these judges out. Was low. Mission accomplished. Absolutely. He is a phenomenal grappler. He said that he held the advantage there, and that would show itself in the fight. He proved that, and he gets a submission. That was good. Amazing.
That was good. Wild round and a wild sequence there on the ground. He rocked my shit in that first half, though. I ain't gonna lie, that first, that first match. I don't understand how people don't know that this guy wants to submit you. You're not the true champ. You restarted. Shut your ass up. Specialist we've seen. Fuck is you talk about? We send it in there now to Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 52 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke. And new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Pitty Boy. Why is Dana White so lifeless on here? It's not because he's not talking. He's just off. He looks off. The coach doesn't look off. He's not talking. I'm either ready. I want to celebrate with the champ. That should have got us to 500,000. Yeah, the champ is here. Oh, my God, what a fight. I'm the best. I'm the champ. Hell, yeah, you are. All the hard work paid off. Man. I just want you to know, I really couldn't have done it without you guys. Nah, I don't know about that. You're a special fighter. Maybe you wouldn't have got here so fast or looked so good doing it, but you always have potential. We couldn't have got here without you either, kid. Oh, that means a lot, coach. Okay, now you're the champ, okay? I didn't plan nothing. You're supposed to have some kind of crazy after party at the club, right? So what we doing? Huh? We popping bottles, we getting pony rides. Come on, coach. What do you mean? Oh, come on. You didn't plan anything? Again? What we gonna do now? I know, I know, I know. I'm the coach, but guess what? You're the champ, kid! Yeah! I am! Let's go! <laughs> Davis MMA! You're Woo! A champion. Can we see the fight totals, please? I probably could've, if I'd have kept going, I wobbled him twice. One knockdown apiece. More strikes, more significant. More takedowns, better control. I think I. So, second round, I definitely won. We were tied. We were actually tied. No, I was winning. I was up a point. I was actually up a point. I didn't realize that. And that's okay, cool. Oh my god, we the champion. Oh my god. Ah, man. On to the next one, guys.